oh my gosh, guys, day 19 out of 21, February the 1st, to Ray. I'm Allie, come hang out on Facebook, Intuitive Healing with Allie Duzette. Let's all be best friends in there. Okay, we've got a stellium today. Ooh, la la, here it is. It's uh, the new moon because the sun and the moon are together here in the chart in Aquarius. And you can see the sun is at 12 degrees. The moon is at 17 degrees and Saturn is smack dibbity dabs in the middle at 15 degrees of Aquarius. So what we have here is called a stellium. This is a big energy day for our core sense of self, our inner emotions and Saturn. Saturn deals with consequences. It deals, it calls our consequences back to us. And so this is going to happen for everybody today. Pay attention today to what happens to you. This is a Saturn day for everyone in the whole world. Everybody in the whole world is getting to experience their consequences, their natural consequences. Oh, and look at this, a little square, this little red line between Uranus and the sun. This is going to mean it might be a little unexpected. You might have some unexpected surprises uh, as far as what is getting called back to you. Have we been up to good or bad? Today is the day that we will get to kind of get a little glimpse of what our internal Saturn is up to. So, and I just way oversimplified it. So just to be clear, that was way oversimplified. Okay, Saturn is not just about quote unquote good or bad choices coming back to you. It's not about that. What it is actually about is, are you in alignment with reality or not? Okay, this is, this is not necessarily about like, are you serving others? Are you being nice? It's more about, is the internal part of your soul in alignment with what is true? Okay, so for example, I think a, one example of this is um, going to be uh, if you believe that you are good, you know, if you are, if you believe you are good enough, right? So a lot of people have like self-esteem issues and stuff. Um, but the truth is that you are good and you are good enough. And um, so if you get caught up in believing that you're not, um, that is putting you out of alignment. Okay. So if you beat yourself up in your own heart, that is out of alignment with universal law and with reality. Okay. Um, okay. So this is not just about like, were we nice to other people? Have we been nice to people? No, that's not it. The real issue is, are we living in alignment with what is true. And so another example of this is with boundaries. Okay. I get a lot, a lot, a lot of emails and messages from parents who have kids that have troubles, right? I mean, adult children. I mean, they're adult children in rehab. That is what I get a lot of requests about. Can you please just fix my kid in rehab? Okay. This is a great example of being out of alignment with reality because the reality is no, your child needs to help themselves, like not, not you personally, but you know, this idea that we need to have good boundaries and allow people to experience their experience. And even if we're their parent, we can't control their life. We can't save their life. Nobody can save anybody else. We all have to choose into our own choices, right? And so a lot of people will say, oh, I'm, but I'm such a good person. Why is my life so hard? And their Saturn is reflecting back to them. And, oh, do you need to go potty? No, sorry, guys. Oh, come here. Um, and so, uh, sorry, my three-year-old just came out to say hi. <laughs> just woke up. So anyway, um, so anyway, we can, we can do what we think is good, right? We can enable the people that we love all around the clock we can pour money at people that are going to not even benefit from it because their mindset is not in a space where they can benefit from that um, and we can sit there and say well i'm doing everything right but are we really you know and saturn reminds us of where we're not right you know of where the things that we thought were good choices are really just bad boundaries and false beliefs okay what is good is not always what is nice, 
right? I don't know if you guys have seen that musical Into the Woods. I hate the Disney version of it, but I love the old one with Bernadette Peters. And I, I mean, I just, I just love that show so much. It's so good. Um, but it has a whole lot going on in the original version. The Disney version took out a lot of the songs that kind of like influence the theme of the whole movie. Um, but anyways, one of the songs just says, nice is different than good. And that's so true. Being nice is different than being good. And Saturn will remind us of that. Saturn is the mirror of our internal world. Okay, so is your internal world in great shape or does it need some work? And um, the answer to that is, uh, well, well, we'll kind of see it today. How does today go? So today's your invitation to clean up your inner world. The Pluto return is around the corner now. I mean, it's just days away. So now is the time to clean up your inner world. I wanted to invite you to get on alleydoesatclasses.com. Get on there today, spend some time in the free offerings. There's sessions in there, there's lessons in there that are all about cleaning up your inner world so that when Saturn is reflecting your inner self back to you, it's a joy and a delight and not a misery. Okay, guys, have a great day. You're gonna rock it. Ah, you're doing good. Bye.